Richard, we're so happy to see you here today and such a dynamic role that you're doing in Law and Order, but we know that you're also diversifying with doing Good Trouble and other shows along those lines. What does it feel like being somebody that can really appeal to multi-generations? I mean, it's a blessing, you know, it's, it's amazing, it's, it's fun, it's fun to still be here and doing it, you know, at the highest level and uh, had a good time on Being Mary Jane and Good Trouble is really great and we got Bosch coming out, so it's a lot, you know, it's, it's a fun time, yeah, it's a lot of work and uh, a lot of different characters I get to play, so I'm lucky, yeah. What are you most looking forward to tonight? Uh, just all the great writers, I, you know, I love the writing, obviously everything starts with the writing, with the words, so... Um, it's, it's an amazing room to be in. With the box, are there anything new that we can really look forward to? Oh, uh, wow. Well, we got a lot of shows coming in. You know, we got, uh, I'm recurring on the Have and Have Nots and, and Bosch on, the, on uh, Amazon Prime. And yeah, we got Good Trouble that's running right now. And, and well, so I don't know, there's a few other things going on. I think um, uh, All Rise. Yeah, so there's a lot of recurrence right now, yeah. Uh, we're just in the golden time for television. So if you had to pick, what show are you binging on right now and so obsessed with? You know, I just recently started binging on The Magicians, actually, which is really a good show. Um, so, uh, Succession, obviously, yeah, is really great, and um, just, it's just, it is so much, there's so much good, good work right now, it's crazy. And lastly, if you just had to pick a film that really led you here, in terms of what inspired you to be an actor, what would it be? Mm, well, you know, well, I guess without dating myself, I'd probably have to go back to like Shaft and you know some of the the iconic you know black heroes that we had in the '70s. You know, I think that really inspired me. Speaking of black heroes, you know we're here in Los Angeles and we just had a great passing with Kobe Bryant. What was your reaction to that? Devastated, devastated. Uh, I met Kobe um, when he was first coming into the, into the league. Um, I was doing a celebrity uh, game at the Staples Center and he was there and, and he was so poised, he was everything that he is and was now and uh, just an amazing man and it's, it's, it's crazy, 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 crazy sad and having a daughter, you know, and knowing what that is, I just could not imagine what it was like for him to um, be there in that moment and realize his daughter was with him, his, you know, his special baby and uh, it's just, it's, it's heartbreaking, totally, yeah. Thank you. Completely, completely here for all the girl dads. Thank you so much for talking with us.